Mickey, Dad, and I are transporting our vehicles. We're on the Crooked Creek, and we are chasing the elusive smallmouth. Now, they're not that elusive. We easily catch plenty, but first time on this creek, Crooked Creek up at Pyatt, and we are Turn left onto Sharps Bend Road. turning left onto Sharps Bend Road, going to the snow access to drop a vehicle. We'll swim this pilgrimite across here. Fishing's been really slow. Caught a few little smallies. I'm talking eight, nine inch smallies uh, off camera. Just because we have fished a lot. And I mean, I didn't ran one battery down and uh, haven't really caught anything. So far I've caught one little green sunfish. It was a pretty big green sunfish. And uh, caught two small smallies, about probably eight, 10 inches each. I mean, nothing, nothing very big yet. But we got a lot of river to go. <laughs> Woo, yeah! Paddle on the run. Am I gonna make it? Am I gonna get there? Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You got anything you want to say? Awesome ride. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, there he is. There he is. Woo, come on, come on. It's a good one. Got him. Look at there, look at there. He hit the old Hilgramite. Thank you, Lord. Boy, he come right off that shallow right there. He and missed it and came back and hit it on top. There he is, there he is. Get in there. Got him. I got a paddle. Let's see if I can fish this. No. Oh, he messed my bait up. Oh, come on, I wanna hold on.
Oh, oh, yes. Tight line him out from behind that stump. Did you see that? I love tight lining them. That's awesome. Oh, look at that. Just barely hooked that joker. Get out of there, buddy. There he is. I just tight lined him like this right out from behind that stump. I love finding them root wads underwater and tight lining them fish out of there. There he is, that. Oh. Oh running straight to me. I don't know what it is yet. There he is. He's about to come up. There he is. There he is. Oh, yeah. Look at here. Boy, this has got some beautiful markings. Oh, he probably just splattered the camera. Oh, man. Thank you, Lord. What a pretty fish. Look at that guy. Man, he's pretty. My camera even on? Yeah, there we go. Look at his tail, it's banged up. Erp, erp. Boy, he's pretty. He's probably 11 inches. Yeah, that was pretty good. Beautiful water. Man. Oh, it's beautiful. So beautiful right here. Holy moly. Thank you, Lord, for this beautiful water. If I can just get through it without flipping. Oh, where's a largemouth? Oh, he just came off right freaking there. <gasps> oh, there was a big one behind that one. Oh, I had a nice one, and that big one was chasing that one. Yeah, that was a nice one. Oh, yeah. There he is. That ain't that bats, though. Long year. 
Man, yeah, I just saw two really nice bass. I, I had one hooked and another one was chasing it, but he came off. Probably a two pound bass. There he is. Nope, that's an Ozark bass. This an Ozark bass here. It's real light. Oh, 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 what have we got? Oh, he's fighting. Small mouth. There he is. Lord, he is beat up. All these fish are beat up for... Oh, that's the little freaking leeches. Thank you, Lord. That smallmouth hit that little rooster tail right out in the middle. There he is. What we got this time? Oh. <laughs> Oh, long ear. Oh, go. Well, he's long ear hitting this rooster tail to not lose it. That's for sure. He's pretty. Got a oh, yeah, pee on me. He's got a lot of blue in him. Oh, that was a hard hit, whatever that was. Another smolly. Yes, sir. It's a rooster tail I'm throwing right now. I've got a strainer coming. Well, that's a few more smallies than I've caught so far on the whole river, that little stretch. There's a little one chasing it right now. I can see him. A little long ear. Down to my last battery. So, I'll go ahead and say if you haven't subscribed to the channel and you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Click all so you don't miss any videos or updates. And uh, hey, go fishing. Whole other level outdoors. That's what I like to say. Let's get out here. It's a whole other level than what you get. Sitting at home or sitting behind a desk or whatever you do for a living. Or if you can't get out here and you enjoy being able to see it through the eyes of this camera, let me know. I love bringing it to you. It's so peaceful and quiet out here. I know a lot of people are always saying I need to talk more in my videos. Uh, sometimes I feel like I just need to shut up and just let nature talk. Nobody wants to hear me mumble about nothing. 
at this video and watch this video, you hear the wind, the birds, the water, deer, and everything. I mean, it's just awesome. Oh, oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. He stays on. Oh. <laughs> Oh, yes. Oh, ultralight smallie action. Stay on, buddy. Oh, it's a largemouth. Yeah. And he has a belly full. Look at there. He hit that little rooster tail. Oh, look at that. Look at that belly on that guy. About a pound. Come right off this bank. Thank you, Lord. Now I'm hung up over here with my bait. That's a pretty good little largemouth. All right, hooker might. Oh, I'm getting back, getting back. Oh, there he is. Oh, get out of there. Oh, yeah. Another large mouth. Large yeah. Got that one on the Helger mite. Thank you, Lord. Get out of here. I've got a good one on. I didn't get the hook set on him. I can get him up here. That's what I'm talking about. No, Smalley. I set him down here for just a second. Get over here. He hammered that old Helgramite. Tad gummit. I did not have my dang camera on again but I got part of the fight boy he hammered that hell or not trying to be easy on him now that's a dandy right there boys right at 14 look at that belly Beautiful. Let's let him go. Save him for another day. Thank you, Lord. I probably caught three or four that were 14 inches. Um, which is not bad. It's not bad. Uh, they were slow. This river, this stretch today is very shallow and not very many pools of deep water. Every deep water pool I found, I caught fish. Um, caught a lot of brim, caught a lot of bass, caught some largemouth, some smallies. But uh, takeout's just, just down the way a little bit, so we're gonna head down there pretty soon, jump in a truck. Probably get something to eat because I'm hungry. Um, but this battery is about dead. I've said it before and it's it's on the blink. Like it's blinking at me now. So probably gonna turn it off. But uh, man, I've had a, had a great day with Mickey and dad. Uh, met some uh, nice people out here from um, Crooked Creek Outfitters. Uh, can't remember the lady's name, but she was a nice lady and uh um so yeah so here we are crooked creek about to wrap it up go fishing